So we said uh, we should make school feeding home based. This program became so popular that people started calling it homegrown school feeding. School feeding is a $75 billion global industry that needs a reliable source of food. More than 368 million children worldwide get at least one meal a day at school. And yet, each day, 66 million children go to school hungry. And when children don't eat, they don't learn. Where school feeding is most needed, it is often incomplete, unsustainable, or unable to provide nutritious food. In the same communities, smallholder farmers unable to reach a market struggle to make a living selling their food. The solution is clear. Local food for local children. From this, a new school feeding movement is gaining momentum in Africa. It's called Homegrown School Feeding. These programs are a win-win for communities. Smallholder farmers benefit from a stable market and children enjoy healthy and nutritious school meals. Connecting farmers to the school market and feeding children healthy, nutritious meals is complex and varies from place to place. It sounds simple, but it's not one size fits all. It's complex and contextual. HGSF programs are designed creatively to meet local needs, cultures, and tastes. It's the only way to learn what works and what doesn't. When governments work across sectors, they connect the dots linking agriculture to nutrition to education. Then school children eat. Then in turn, they learn. Farmers are able to access markets and in turn, communities prosper. The evidence is clear. Homegrown school feeding works. When school children eat, they learn. And when they eat fresh local food, everyone wins. Mm -hmm.